guys welcome back to my channel i am deanna nicole and this is my morning routine so i woke up around 4 50 ish so that i could turn my light on and turn my camera on and then i got straight back in the bed i typically would wake up right at five but because i was doing this video i wanted to wake up a little bit earlier and when I get back in the bed, I try to stay awake and just get on social media um, for about 10 to 15 minutes. So I don't actually get out of the bed until around 5.15 ish. Then once I'm out the bed, I just go ahead and start getting ready to make my bed. This particular day that I decided to do my morning routine, I was on my period and I don't know if any of my ladies understand the feeling of having night sweats, but I literally will go to sleep freezing, but be drenched in sweat. And so those particular nights, I sleep on a towel, as you could see. And so I'm just removing the towel before I start making my bed. Just as a disclaimer, I don't wake up at 5 o'clock in the morning every single morning. Um, I alternate between 5 a.m. and 6 a.m. Um, but 5 a.m. days are when I am driving back to Atlanta, but I have to get a certain amount of work done, which is what was going on in this day. So next thing I did was just brush my teeth, and now I'm quickly rinsing off my face, getting all the, bu getting all the eye boogers out, you know. The next thing that I did was prepare my morning cup of water. Um, I found that drinking a cup of cold water in the morning really helps me wake up. And as y'all can see, I'm super tired. I was yawning every five seconds. But drinking a cold cup of water in the morning, well, maybe not just cold, but a cup of water in general first thing in the morning is really, really good for your health. And so I've been trying to incorporate that into my morning routine. The next thing that I do is I start putting my dishes away. Um, I opened a new box of dishes. I got plates, bowls, and all of that. So I, I washed them last night, um, or the night before, I guess. Um, and so I was just putting those away. And now I am making my morning bowl of oatmeal i'm currently trying to gain weight um so i do a little pre-breakfast before i go to the gym um i don't eat a lot it's really hard for me to eat a lot i don't know i just have a small stomach or something i don't know but obviously i can't gain weight if i don't eat so i'm trying to do more meals in the day and this is one of them i'm um eating my oatmeal with almond milk instead of regular milk like I usually do since I'm about to head to work out. Regular milk sometimes makes my stomach hurt once I start jumping around and getting hot so almond milk tastes really good anyway. I took out my oatmeal and while it was cooling down I went in my room and just threw out some clothes to wear to the gym don't judge how plain my room is right now like I said we're in the process of decorating and finishing and everything so yeah and then I head back in the kitchen and I eat my oatmeal so then I just head to the gym I got my AirPods, my water, all of that jazz, and I'm going to my apartment gym. 
Unfortunately, Athens is in the middle of nowhere, and so there aren't very many options for gyms out here. And I prefer gyms like LA Fitness or One Life that are a little bit more calm, you know? But all we have out here is Crunch, so, or the university gym, which is not my cup of tea. So I work out in my apartment gym when I'm in Athens. After my warm up, I lifted some weights and then I had a little dance break so I could feel myself. I do this every time I go to the gym. It makes me feel better when I look at myself and I'm just like, I may not look any different right now, but I feel good. And that's pretty much all I'm doing right here. Then I head back to my apartment, turn on some tunes and put on my gloves so that I can wash dishes. If y'all don't wear gloves to wash dishes, then I commend you because I cannot wash dishes if I feel anything floating around in the water. It literally makes my skin crawl and I just can't. So yeah, I wear gloves. Then I'm jumping straight into making my breakfast. Um, this particular day I made bacon, egg, and cheese sandwich on regular honey wheat bread and um, pouring myself um, some Green Machine Naked Smoothie. I broke my little blender so I just buy Naked Smoothies now until I remember to get a new blender. Then once my breakfast is pretty much done, I start making my lunch. Um, this particular day I did, or week I guess, I didn't meal prep, so I had to make my lunch each day. This day I was doing um, bacon turkey sandwich. So I'm making the bacon now. I like to get all of this done. Like I literally pack up my entire lunch, everything, put it in the fridge before I even sit down to eat my breakfast. I was just being greedy right here. I needed a bite. Um, but yeah, I finish up my lunch and put it in the fridge before I eat my breakfast. And there's Lilo. She's had some eggs, kibble, and a little bit of salmon for breakfast. And then I had my breakfast sandwich with some oranges, grapes, and my little smoothie. Then I head into my bathroom so that I can take a shower, which is much needed because I was so wetty. I turn on my relax playlist and I pretty much let it play until I am completely dressed and headed out the door. Um, yeah, so now that I'm out the shower, I just go ahead and start getting ready. First thing I do out the shower is put my contacts in. I don't really like wearing my glasses on a day-to-day -day basis, um, unless my lashes look really awful. Um, they're really good at um, covering the gaps but I typically prefer to walk around with my contacts instead of my glasses. And then I'm just getting into my face routine. Fairly um, basic, to be honest. Not as extensive as some others that I know, um, but it works for me. And then I jump into my makeup. So this was a pretty chill day, so 
all I did was some concealer, my brows, and put on some, I want to say I just put Vaseline on if I'm being honest, but I could be lying. I might have, might have done a good little gloss. Once I finish up my make my makeup, I pack up all my makeup and start getting my clothes up for the day. Um, I was pretty basic with my outfit this particular day. I literally wore a white crop top and some gray biker shorts and my NBA All-Star hat. Um, I was going into the lab, but I wasn't doing any lab work, so I didn't feel the need to be any more covered than I was. Um, if I were going to be doing bench work, I might have wore some long pants or something, but I'm a computational student, so majority of my work is actually sitting at a desk. So when I go into the lab, most times it's usually just to um, be more productive in my desk area versus working at home. Um, and sometimes I go into the lab because I do have some bench work to do. <laughs> actually go to Atlanta almost every single weekend pretty much every weekend I'm not gonna lie um I go to Atlanta every weekend because I just don't like being in Athens on weekends I like to go where my friends and my line sisters and my boyfriend are and so I'm just packing up my bag because I'm gonna be gone until about Tuesday so sorry I completely missed recording making my iced coffee and everything but I did that and then I got my lunch out the fridge and headed to campus um, I'm including me in the lab a part of as my morning routine because I actually do my devotionals and plan out my day while I'm in the lab I have the tendency to get stuck when I do that at home and get a little sidetracked so when I get into the lab I pull out my laptops my iPad and my notebook um, you know turn everything on plug anything in that's necessary and then I actually log into my devotional um, I'll link the particular devotional that I'm working on now in my um, description box um, but what I do is I do my devotional and I actually pick out something that stuck with me a bible verse or a quote or anything that stuck with me and I write it in my to-do list notebook um, at the top so every time I look at my to-do list I see whatever that quote is whatever that Bible verse is and it kind of motivates me to keep going um, and then after I do my devotional I just go check my email check my calendar and I check my weekly to-do list and I pick out tasks from that to-do list and write it into my notebook for the day so that I know that I'm staying on top of everything once I do all of that, um, that is my prep for the day, to be honest. Once I do that, I just go ahead and I get ready to start working. I want to say this particular day, I was um, working on some data processing for um, some samples that I'd run a few weeks before. So for my 5 a.m. morning routines, I wake up and my goal is to typically get into the lab around 8 o'clock. Um, so yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed watching my little routine. Um, it changes fairly often, but as of right now, that is my morning routine. Um, and yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and you subscribe to my channel, like it, all of that jazz, and I will see you in my next video. Bye!